other than episode of E E N E with E N everything educating and entertaining with Animal Tommy. I trust you guys enjoyed the last video I did as regarding how to use hashtag and you've been able to practice and you've seen effective results. So on today's episode of E E N E with AM, I'll be talking about a disturbing topic it has been trending for a while and it's looking like people are not taking that into serious consideration so therefore I have a visitor in the house to you know talk about the since it's a girl thing I feel I should have somebody by my side hi join me as I welcome Miss Matiwa Hello, Good afternoon and so nice to have you on E E N E with so here here Thank you for joining. So guys, today like I said, we have a girl topic to discuss and the topic is about rape. I mean, this thing is very disturbing. It's a serious issue that our government, our parents and the society is not paying attention to. In fact, the least place, the most sacred place you think is the second home and you feel safe happens to be the place where we even get hurt. And it's looking like everybody's turning a non child attitude to our set. Remember the story of the girl? Yeah, the girl kid. in Vinny, right? Mm -hmm. Oh my god, when I story, I was like, basically, I was almost crying. Because I was like, so how could something like this, something so vile, no. happen in a church? I, I mean, this should be your safe space, right? Yes. Where you go to and you're safe. And mm -hmm. like, this happened in a church, I was devastated. Like, Regardless of the story behind it, it still doesn't justify whatever happens. Oh. Well. I mean, you, you see, this thing of a rape or being a rapist, I'm very sure it's something of the mind. Yeah, it it's is. a psychological thing mm -hmm. because I see no reason why you see a fellow lady or a young girl under 18 or over 18 mm -hmm. and you and just, you know, it just means that you you're not um you don't have self control. Of course. I mean, and a human being does not have self control. Self control would um you could you know liken him to an animal. Mm -hmm. But that's even worse for you because even animals have self control. Sure. And animals do not rape. I mean, as far as I know, I'm not an animal that rapes. Then the colors I animal. Exactly. Mm -hmm. So I, I don't understand why you would see someone forcefully um take them and mm -hmm. have um carnal knowledge of them without mm -hmm. them like what is the pleasure you even get from that? Exactly. Me? And that brings us to the word consent because if a lady doesn't give you a go ahead like yes you can have me yes you can do it yeah. it's just it has seems, to be right exactly it yeah. seems like being a rapist yeah if you're about to penetrate and she said no no is no our governments are not doing anything to put strict measure on this thing all, at all um i think this um uh, basically stems from the kind of society we live in yeah we all know that we live in a very strict like yeah. nigeria is a strict country very we have true. parents that are very strict mm -hmm. and um sadly even though with this year 2020 we're all tech you know we all have technology and everything mm -hmm. is all big we still have some people with very very that mentality really? is somehow so, messed up yeah you know some men would hear this and be like eh Oh, she wears. Exactly. Where did she wear? I'm like, asking. dude, like we're so past that. Yeah, That's not please. the point. The point is that you don't have the right. It's my body. Yeah. You don't have the right to touch it unless I give you that right and I of tell course. you, oh, I want it. It's the okay. same thing that goes for your body. Mm -hmm. As a man, if you don't want a girl to touch you, you have the right to say no. no. Simple. Exactly. So the reason why, like, um, the society or the police force are things about it, because some of them say my like, I <laughs> beg. Now, so I believe the government should start doing something about yeah. it and this rape of the thing doesn't really really restrict to ladies alone A lot of guys, a lot of men are involved in this thing but they are so shy to talk about it You know, being the kind of society we live in yeah. where you like you have to man up yeah. and keep it quiet yeah. Shame you know, them and all that Exactly That's another issue I think there should be measures put in place concerning the rape And also I think parents should start talking about the things we yes doing. that's also a very mm -hmm. important part because yes. this builds i mean it also helps our children mm -hmm. you know when you don't build their confidence their trust level with you mm -hmm. nobody wants to come out and talk and be like oh you know this uncle touched me here yes. or this auntie it's like you're supposed to open it should be like an open communication you know role you know you know your you sit daughter can come to you and be like oh mommy i don't like what happened to me this guy so, so you know you should even before and after it happens yes. most people don't even speak up exactly. because the way their parents are treated or the way the parent reacts to things like that. Mm -hmm. So I think parents should stop shying away from yeah. topics like rape, both female and male. Because you need, yes, yes. you need to enlighten them so they don't get the information elsewhere. Okay. In a very wrong 
wrong with it. So I believe with this it will help society and it will help everybody around you. Okay? And also parents, when you have visitors in your house, make sure you look at your children. Like it's so crazy. You should even be monitoring the kind of people you have in your house. Wow. I mean you can't trust everybody that's i mean even fathers rape their daughters that's how bad it has gotten and, and the worst part of it is not even the fact that the rapist has done what he has to do and leave it's the fact that at the end of the day the person the victim has to go through some yes. traumatic situation yes. and some problems that you wouldn't even be able to you know mm -hmm. talk or talk to people and about down the line it affects the way they live the way they relate mm -hmm. to the other people exactly. it's just the mental whole line physical of emotional drama. everything so yeah. current peace take all these things and put into measures yeah. we also feel like our government should also do something like strict policies against rape it's not just about bringing them to justice mm -hmm. it's about doing the necessary things yeah. if they have to die please let them die yeah, yeah. if they have to be castrated please let them be castrated you have to control. exactly so thank you guys for joining on this um, episode you can also draw comments in the comment section please do not forget to subscribe do not forget to click the like button and I'm also going to draw Miss Matilda's information in the comment section so you can also follow her and check her out thank you very much for your time see you next week bye, bye.